Oh no, I just realized that the TCG music was playing along with the opening music. Oh well. Hello everyone, hello! Hope everyone's doing good today. We're going to be playing some Pokemon TCG. I am very excited to uh, play cards because I love card games. I love a lot of things. Card games are one of them. I'm just a, I just love a lot of things kind of guy. What can I say? What are we doing? What are we doing today? Today it looks like we're going to be playing some card games. We're going to be showing off some new decks I've built. And we're just going to see how it goes. Let's see. Hmm. We could start off with Hamter. There we go. Start with what cash? Uh, game? Game. Game? It sounded like it was starting a game, but I don't see a game. There it goes. Oh, no. And it's gone. There it is. Ah, wait, no, I didn't want to go first. Ah, poop. 
Wait, what? Am I playing two games? Hold on. All right, we gotta concede. Okay. All right. And the 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 service has been having some uh some screw up moments lately. But that's okay. But that's okay. We can probably get in some good games. We just gotta we just gotta believe. Try again. Here we go. The music didn't change, but okay. Or did it? Let's go Tails. Perfect. I wanted to go second. Good, good. All right, all right. See, we'll put the squawk down just in case we want to use it after the Iona. But what we want to do is to get... Uh, at least one wish cash down. Oh man, I really should have put a Manaphy in this deck. Oh well, it'll be fine. Keep forgetting Greninja is like uh, really, really good against this deck if Manaphy's not here. This looks like probably just a basic Chim Pao deck. With Badoof. With Bebaral. Bibarali. Okay. Is that your turn? That is his turn. Um, he's probably going to be pretty thankful. Ooh, this is what I wanted. VIP, let's go. Let's get me a uh, Beldum and... A barboak. And then throw a squawkabilly down. Throw energy there. Will I own no? Good. Another horsey. Uh, honestly, the squawk ability is kind of going to go to waste because I don't really want to discard this hand. And I don't really have much to play afterwards. The Irida can get me the rare candy. You know what? No, actually, let's use the squawk, squawk ability. What I want to do is stop his momentum, so... Path, escape rope, and a squawkabilly. And we'll intern there. There we go. All right, now I've got Iona so I can draw some cards next turn. All right, I am unmuted, right? Yes, okay, good. This would be very awkward if I was just talking and like narrating and nothing was happening. But the path will stop uh, Chin Pao from getting energy in the hand. It'll stop Greninja from being able to use concealed cards to draw him more cards. Unless he gets a field spell out too. Oh, he already lost vacuums. Oof. All right. Well, that was bound to happen. What's he going to get rid of? It's rid of a heavy ball. Goodbye, heavy ball.
There's Frigibax. Best ball, probably for a gym pal. Oh no, Palkia. Okay, alright. That is fair. That is Irida. What are you going to get? Because I'm just going to make you lose it next turn, so unless you can play it now. Okay, so they probably already have the rare candy in the hand. Oh wait, playing the Ultra Ball, which means you don't have the rare candy in the hand. Why? Alright. Oh, the Biberol. Okay. You want to get your draw engine going. Yeah, that's worth losing, losing a Frigid back, so you can always get it back. There's Tian Pao. Alright, do you have a way to switch? Nope, no switching. Okay. Alright, what we got? Nest ball. Grab a diglet. Alright, then we'll go ahead and I don't know. Alright, let's see. Alright, cool, we got Bronzong. That's good. But, that's about it. <laughs> Truthfully, we won't be able to get the deck going until he knocks out one of my Pokemon, so... We're just gonna have to wait on that as well. Maybe we should put some Gift Energy in here to give me a draw. Oh, here we go. Alright, now we're gonna get cooking. Gonna get the Frigibax and the Rare Candy. Oh no, Palkia. I can't even, well, probably already has Frigibax. Yep. Or Baxcalibur, yeah. Super energy retrieval, but I don't think you've lost that much energy. Only two, right? If I recall. Yeah. Alright, that's what you gotta play, that's what you gotta play. Oh, you had an extra skaters park. Alright, that, that partially explains it. So put the two energy on Bibrol, then retreat into Chien Pao. Grab two more energy, and then you have enough to knock out uh, Squawk Ability. Oh, unless you're just going straight for Palkia. I wish it would make more sense. You'd be losing less energy on, on the go around. But if you do Chip Pal, you can get two more energy out of your deck. Huh? I guess not. I guess they're cool with just the two. I guess I'll put it on Chip Pal for backup. Although the smart play would be to put it on Greninja. Yep, there it is. I need to get to evolve in some of these guys. Luckily, they've already retreated. All right. get what we need down all right I need another reversal energy and a whisk cash perfect Is 
that I didn't get the wish cash, but I did get the gift energy. So this will let us do some milling. It's a damn shame I didn't get another uh, Milida, Merida. I could have got a uh, Kingdra out faster. Okay, probably gonna go for the Cedra and the Barboke, probably. Alright, who you chopping? Yep, Cedra, as I thought. And, oh! Wiglet, alright. Worried about the Wug Trio, I guess. Mm, yeah, without the Mana Fee, I don't think we're going to be able to get a win. Unless I can involve both of them. It would be great, mind you. I'm not too confident we can make it happen. Well, then there's that, so that's good. Maybe we have a chance after all. No, probably not. Yeah, without Kanger to be able to recycle the reversal energies. Oh, I'm not putting them on the Greninja. Okay. I guess they just want to go straight on for the kill. Uh, we did not get a good start to this match. Or well, we got like a decent start, but then we just couldn't get uh, the stuff we needed to like make it go through. I could really go for would be like a boss's order. Yeah, sadly none of that's going to help me. Oh well. Is that could use a bit more fine tuning, I guess. Alright, bud. Just go for the kill. I don't even know if I saw a single rare candy. Hopefully they both weren't prized. Alright, note to self. Need to add Mana Feed that deck. Can't believe I forgot about the Greninja. Is 
but it's okay. Alright, let's use Hamster Deck. Nope, nope. Oh no, is it doing it again? I can't tell if it's starting up two different games again. Heads? Okay, no, maybe we're good. Yes. Okay, alright, I guess we're good. Let's go, electric hamster! It was supposed to do an update tomorrow on this game. I'm hoping that it'll fix a lot of the issues it's been having. Oh, speaking of Manaphy, what's up? Oh, Raikou. Let's go put down Pidgey. Ooh, no, wait, Mew. Nope, 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 Pidgey. All right, let's see, generator, what do we got? One, one's good. So let's switch over the Raikou just so I can get some draw in. Escape rope? Okay, that's a good one. It'd be nice if the opponent played Niono or something, but we'll see. Battle VIP. What you draw on today? Ooh, Lost Box. Okay. Alright, we can work with this. Let's see, are you going to Colrus? Are you going to one turn uh, Cramorant? Oh, what did you do? Get rid of your Giratina? Oh, that's a pretty Giratina. Oh, nice, you got another Battle VIP. Talks for me, but hey. Not an option for faster, is there? Not all options. Is that the only one? Oof. Yep, sure enough. Looks like they got four into their lost box.
Yeah, it doesn't don't think they're gonna play an Iona. Sadly. Yep, there's the cram. You got the switch. Jet energy. Okay. You just want to get all the cards in here, don't you? Oh, you hadn't even retreated yet. Yep, yep, there we go. That was smart. It's not looking good for this Hamter. Oof. All right, let's do a draw. Research. Research is good. Okay. And we'll get rid of those. Get in Mew. Alright. Nice. Alright, I like this. Okay. We need Pidgeot. Pidgeot's going to give us what we need. And what we need right now is an energy. We can at least knock out this cram. Right, and next turn, what we can do is, when he knocks out Raikou, we'll switch to Mew, see if we can't get another rare candy, get double palm mocked, and then research. Sadly, Path to the Peak won't do anything against this Lost Box. So no real reason to throw that out there. It'll just hamper, hamper Pidgeot. I imagine he'll get something to knock out the Raikou this turn. If not, if he actually gets like a Giratina or something, then we'll just use uh, Pidgeot to grab a boss's order and see about uh, getting some early damage on the Giratina. All right, where are they at? Should be getting close to 10, right? It'll be 7. Wait, do they have a V and a Giratina in there? Oof. Off break. Hi, Posen Pie! <laughs> For a minute, I thought it was going to be the Game Boy 1. Uh, I do have streams of the first and second Game Boy 1 on my VOD channel. And with the Game Boy 1 being on the Switch recently, I got that. I perfectly understand it. <laughs> But there was a new set that came out for this, uh, I want to say like a week and a half ago at this point. So, and I really do like the modern card game. I mean, it, it's kind of bullshit. The meta is frustrating sometimes. Yeah, if you have uh, Switch Online, you can get the uh, first Pokemon TCG on the uh, the Game Boy. There you go. See, told you. Told you they get the cram ran out. It's all according to Cake. Oh, you're very welcome. What's what's cool about it too, Posen Pie, is that uh, if you uh, connect to other, uh, go if you like play it online with other people, you can actually do the card pop even on the Switch version. Oh no! Don't go after the Palmots. I haven't evolved them yet. I'm so close to evolving them. You better just put the cram right out. Okay, good. Oof. 
I've been good. I have technical issues abound. <laughs> There's a lot of things. I don't know why this is running so slow. The mobile, it runs super fast. There it goes. Now watch this. The experience chair. Well, let me put an experience on Palmot there. Cool ham. You know what? I am a pretty cool ham. Let's go ahead and celebrate it. Yeah. All right. Let's get Mew out. See if we can't grab a rare candy. All right, Mew. Give us rare candy. Crap. Eh, escape rope's still good. All right, anything in here I need to take back? Amon and the energy. Okay, cool. All right. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to Super Rod. Get Palmot and Energy back in the deck. Watching any anime currently? Uh, just the basic uh, Isekai stuff that's going on right now. Like Sweet Factory and uh, Jobless Reincarnation. What else? Oh, Vending Machine. That, that's a very cozy one. I'm having a lot of fun watching that. Let's see. Wait, can I look at this thing? 60 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Sadly, I can't do that with... Uh, with Manaphy out there. Yeah, no, it's it's super it's super like uh like relaxing to watch. It's a very feel good kind of flow. Alright. Uh let's see, is there anything else I'm watching? I did that too early. Oh well, that'll be fine. Expecting it to be stupid, but there's actual substance. Yeah, it does get the feel. Oh, uh, the kitchen remake? Oh, dang it, I still I keep forgetting that that's out. I'm going to keep that Mew in my hand. Pacing is on point with the OG. Definitely need to give it a watch. I'll probably end up feeling uh, giving it like a uh, like a marathon one day. Ooh, uh, The Great Cleric. I started that up because my friend was like, yeah, they've been stuck on episode six for a while. Uh, so I gave it a watch. And then like as soon as I gave it a watch, like two more episodes updated. <laughs> That one is a very, like, interesting one. Like, all the characters are very kind of, like, low-level grounded, like, like especially in their, like, headspace. But it feels like there's actually, like, so much more, like, serious stuff, like, happening that we're, that the main character's not picking up on so that we're not expected to pick up on it. And I'm especially curious about that Substance X and, like, how it's affecting his, like, level and stat growth. That, that, that feels to me like where like the, the big mystery is. I'm all caught up. Uh, I've seen him go into the labyrinth and defeat the boss.
Do it. Kill the Palmon and the Mew. I've got more where that came from. <laughs> Do it, you know you wanna. And then I'm just gonna kill the Giratina. Oh, the point of that, I could probably lose to anything. I really gotta put Manaphy in these decks. Your ninja just like. It's like being too utility. Making me mad. Hey, wait, why didn't the energy go on Palmont? He had I have an escape rope on. Does escape rope only watch the bench? Have you watched the one about the dude who has drops maxed out? Wait, what? No, I haven't. Oh, is that like the uh, the OP skill one? I think I've heard about it. It's good. Okay, I'll have to give that one a watch. No energy there. Hey, if it's still on your watch list after all this time, that's pretty good. Alright, let's shorten this guy's hand down to two. Ooh, this is good. Watch this. I'm gonna... Use Pidgeot. We're going to quick search for that other Palmont. This one here. Ah, wait, crap. I forgot I don't have enough damage. halfway through yeah i dropped uh wait am i the strongest like that like i fell off of that super hard i'm hoping i stopped him jet energy okay he's gonna try and get some more draws in we can get another mirage gate he'll win Oh well, no, he won't win, but he'll stop my plan. I did start watching uh, My Home Hero. I know it's from last season, but I ended up missing it. But uh, the first two episodes of that were really good. Dark Gathering? I haven't heard of Dark Gathering. Let me look that up real fast. While my uh, opponent's doing their turn. Anime Dark Gathering. Oh, it's on High Dive. That's why I haven't heard of it. <laughs> Damn it, High Dive. You and your exclusives. Ah! I might look for another Iono just to keep this guy's hand down. Because that might be the way I have to win. Escape rope. Go Pidgeot. Yeah, free retreat. Ah, that's fair. <laughs> I do not blame you there. You need green energy for that. Okay. You don't have green energy at the moment. Huh. Okay. Let's go ahead. Can't afford after. I'm very lucky. Uh, I have a friend that's letting me use their crunchy roll because I'm kind of right there with you. Everything just got too expensive really fast.
All right, watch this. All right, we're going to grab Manaphy. We're going to electric fist combo. Probably won't let me do this because of Manaphy. Oh, wait. Nope, it didn't. Okay. As long as he doesn't kill this Palmont, I should be able to stay in control. We'll see. Being adult is super expensive. Ugh. All the bills keep going up. Food keeps going up. Everything keeps going up. Yeah, no, I was a huge fan of the OG. And I owned all 28 volumes of the manga. So I, I am totes down to watch it whenever I get a chance. Oh, good. He didn't put down on the Manaphy. All right. Beach Court. All right. Going for that free retreat, I see. Yeah, and I had all the uh, the OAVs, the anime ones. Blood and Betrayal. Or is it Lost and Betrayal? Oh, he just introduced the only Waban. Nice. Yes, that's right. Trust and Betrayal. Ah, so good. I guess technically we'll be getting, uh, if the anime keeps going for like the additional seasons it should, we'll eventually be getting the Trust and Betrayal like in the anime. Man, getting the whole, like, a uh, Aichi. Is it Aichi? Aichi? Uh, the, 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 the true final arc of Kenshin is going to be nuts. We'll get to see the guy that's basically Venom. The guy with the Venom eyes and the long, stretchy arms. We'll get to see him. Oh my god, finish your turn. Alright, did you get Mirage Gate? Yeah, episodes are out. I wonder if it's going to go for a double season or if it's going to have like a uh, split in between. Ooh, Energy Recycler. Okay. Just trying to get some energy back in the deck. Because 13 would be enough for it to finish the like the uh, only Wapon group. Okay, so Mirage Gate is there. Okay. So you did draw it. Pretty dangerous. Because if we got, because uh, if it became, if it was a double link season, like twenty four episodes, we could probably get all the way up to when Saito gets introduced. Oh, all right. So this is how you're going for it. All right. Oh, it is getting twenty four. Sick. All right then. Yeah, we'll get right up to a Shishio. Or, like, right up to the uh, Tokyo arc. All right, let's get rid of that there. What should we do? What should we do? Throw another energy on that. I think I might be able to win this. We'll do Electric Fist. And I'll put 60 damage on this guy. Which means that next turn... As long as he doesn't get a uh, boss's order... Then we should win. But if he gets a boss's order, he will win. So. All down to his draws. Okay, so he wasn't some of the treasures. Okay, good, good. Wait. 
<laughs> Grabbing a dragon Pokemon. I mean, that's fair. You can use it for that too. All right. It looks like he gave up. Or he just realized that uh, that Iona I did, like, really, uh, like, uh, beat him up. Good match, dude. Good match. Oof. I'm curious if the anime returning will generate any more, like, the possibility of a new game or something. I mean, I guess Kenshin was in, like, uh, Jump Forces, so that was cool. Oh, okay, I got both my prizes. Alright. Collect what I got. There's also another game for that on PS3. There was, I believe, a Jump Victory versus or Jump Stars Victory versus or something like that, which was on the PS3. Uh, he also had a PSP fighting game and a PS2 fighting game, I believe. Yeah, Tox is a tree. I've already got that. Oh, and of course, he's also in like the uh, the J Stars games on the uh, DS. Ooh, an absolutely X. What do you look like? Future sight. Look top three cards of either player's deck and put them back in any order. Yeah. If your opponent has three or fewer cards in their hand, second is 120 more damage. Eh, not not that amazing. I don't think so. Alright, let's play a different deck. Let's play uh, Annihilate. Angie Ape. I wish the uh, J Stars games got like. Decent love in their uh, creation. Because that whole like backwards fighting thing. Like it's so it's not bad, but like there it gets to the point where the characters all feel very samey. Like if J-Star has got like the fighters treatment, which would be like a logistics like nightmare in regards to like who owns it. Like, like that'd be that'd be like so fire. All good, dude. Thanks for hanging out. It was fun talking anime with you. You have yourself a good night and a good sleep. I'm probably gonna switch games after this match, just with how slow this game's been going. Us. <laughs> There's our minky. Looks like I'm going to be facing another Chien Pao deck. Yep, there he is. Hi, Chien Pao. Yes, yes, I know. It's you.
Ah, you got lucky. You got lucky with that battle VIP. I wish I had a battle VIP right now. Maybe we should throw a Squawkabilly in this deck. Mm, I think Accutee will just help them more. I don't need that in my life. You're getting Ultra Balled. This isn't good. Not good at all. We got pretty much a brick tan. <laughs> I mean, if next turn we could draw a rare candy, we could turn it around pretty fast, but it'd be, it'd be close. Be close. Up oh, there's the Irida. Uh, Backscalibur coming in. And uh, Bibril too. Yeah, no, this... I'll let them get an attack in in case it's for their... Uh, uh, like, goal or whatever, but then I'm just going to concede. Like, like I, am, I am bricked. What? Oh, okay, yeah, you just want to win that way. That's fine, too. Go ahead. Ooh. Oh man, Greninja has just been my bane all night. Alright, let's try that again. Maybe we'll get better luck. Hello, game? There it goes. Alright, let's go in. Angie Ape. What you doing? I don't mind going second with this deck. If I just get a better draw. <laughs> cool. Although getting first attack is pretty awesome. I'm glad I get first attack, but it's not the first attack that's good. Ooh. This could work out well, actually. Hopefully he kills my Minky. The first one. What are you? Draw cards until you have seven in your hand. Oh, okay. Vengeful punch. <laughs> Maybe I don't want to punch it. Did you ever think of that?
Luckily, I can't even do the attack this turn, so. Mm. Go and grab a Pidgey. Thirty HP. I only do ten, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to take a punch to the face unless I'm going to kill it. All right, well, that's their turn. Mm. Would have liked my plan to have worked out, but oh well. Speaking of my plan not working out. I just can never get VIP, battle VIP when I want it. Oh well. We'll just knock this thing out. Take what prize we can. More energy, yay! Pidgey, huh? You don't really need to stall, unless you're going to evolve it this turn. Oh, Anna? Oh shit, that's great, thank you. Uh, no offense, this hand sucked. <laughs> Happy to get rid of this. Hmm, I thought this is that much better. Yeah, I was gonna say, wait a minute. <laughs> Someone likes their vengeful punch. Say though that Iona didn't really do me any favors. Yeah, that's about all I got. <laughs> oh man. Uh I play so much better on the mobile. I'm just having such poop luck tonight. Oh, thank you for the other Iono. Well, at least we got something that should be able to help. What's the attack do? 210? Okay, good now. Wait. The super rod first. Alright, monkey, monkey, energy. And let's get another monkey in play. Okay, let's give it an energy. Let's search. Go grab us and annihilate.
All right, and instead of doing its big move, we'll just do Seismic Toss. That way, we'll just take the 40 damage, and we won't have to worry about... Oh, it didn't... Why didn't that hurt us? Oh, it's only when it's knocked out. Oh, I'm dumb. Maybe I should read the card. <laughs> That's right, it's going to hit me with the big old damage, right? And then I'm just going to use Cheryl to heal it. We'll lose the energy, but just we need one more energy. Then we can knock out that Charizard. Bada boom, bada bing. Two Pidgeot's good, but you can only use the uh, skill once uh, per turn. So I'm not too worried about there being two of them out. Thankfully, you only use it once per turn. Well, at least all their Pokemon are good to go. Alright, here's where I have fun. We'll do Cheryl. Put one energy. Do a quick search. Grab another, no, grab a rare candy. And then evolve this one. Nice. All right, so we need 150, 180. So 180 divided by, I need 90 damage counters on me. That should be right. Yes. Yes. Sally is going to put me in the realm of getting killed by the Charizard. Should be okay, though. What I definitely need to do is get another Mankey down, because I'm going to need to get the non-EX Primeape ready for action. Oh! Okay, but you can't kill it, though. I guess it was sweet of you to try. Let's go back to this one. Luckily, this will help me out with my little needing a manky problem. Actually, while I'm at it, let's go ahead... Grab Pidgey as well, just to distract them. Hmm, using Iona would give them too much. Alright, how much damage can I take before I die? Is that 190? No. Yep, yeah, so 180. Alright, this is going to be how, how I bait them. But I can only put 12 counters anyway, so... 
spell counters is 200 no 12 damage so that'd bring me to 250 uh darn still not enough to i think to use that but let's go the bait are you gonna go after bruh Ah, wait, the retreat cost is only two. Mm, that's a pain. I might need to look for a path to the peak. Let's stop there, Pidgeot, from being able to get more damage. What to do? What to do? So, Beldritch. Yeah, playing some Pokemon TCG, playing the modern stuff. Okay, I need one energy. That that's a given. If I kill this, then the next one's just gonna be able to come up and wreck it. Cause I'll need at least eight. No, nine. And nine and forty. Bring me to 120, and then yeah, no, that won't do good. Just chilling, nice. It's good to hear. All right, what what can we do? What can we do? Right, let's go grab a card. Oh crap! No, that won't change anything. Ooh, not good. Not good. Okay. Okay. Alright, let's grab right in. That'll let us get an energy on him. Ooh, actually, no, this will be perfect. Then we can grab any one card. We'll just grab another energy. Alright, this way we can knock out the Charizard and only have to deal with the 40 damage. And then if I can get the next turn just right, I should be able to win. It'll be close though. Unless I miscounted in regards to how much damage the Charizard is going to do. Oh, shit, wait, no, okay, no, I think I'm gonna lose, yeah. I forgot I'm taking two prizes instead of one. Yeah, I think I'm dead. <laughs> oh, well, if not, it was a pretty close game. Oh, shit, I don't know, okay. Yep, 3.30. Okay. Yep, he got me. Oh, well, that was a close match. I was happy with that. The only deck I've won with is the Hamter deck. Guess I do have one more deck on hand I can try out. My Mel Mel deck. Game, you're, you're playing the music before the match is starting. Okay. 
Psychic, huh? Okay. This could work out in our favor. I don't think we have any Pokemon that are weak to Psychic. Yes, I would like to go first. Wait. Ah, oh, this game is so broken. We just want something to be able to play the card game good. Yep, yep, all right. One more match and then, then I'm going to call it. <laughs> Really hoping the patch tomorrow fixes a lot of this, just like it basically running. Yay, functional games. I wonder what those are like. <laughs> Honestly, how many matches of Master Duel I've had just crash on me? I it's, The only way I could play mobile game or card games are on the phone. And that frustrates me. I should be getting off the phone more. I heard uh, Marvel Snap recently came out with a desktop version. I never got into that game, but I heard it was actually pretty fun. Which is crazy since, uh, since I'm such a big Marvel nut. It should be something I play. I think I just didn't want to get into another card game at the time. Alright, come on, Tumbles. Unless you're just going through the same problem I just went through. Yep, you sure did. <laughs> it's not just me, it's my opponents as well. Wait, what is going on? All right, all right, Orfeo, let's go. Wait, I'm fighting someone in, in Great League, but I'm in Rookie League. There really no one else playing the card game right now because it's so busted. Come on, Genesect Coin. Yay, thank you, Genesect Coin. Come on, let me get a good draw. Let me get a good draw. Hmm, it's not a terrible draw. Definitely need Magnemite, Bronzor, and Mel Mel. And at least next turn I can do an Iona to get me a give me a fresh hand. Ooh, actually no, I can use this. Just go and draw myself uh, a hand of five, and I don't have to worry about the opponent. Hamster, you clever dog. Mm, Greninja, that could be anything. And Crystal Cave, go there. Ultra Ball. Go here. Sucks to lose all of my Ultra Balls, though. Alright, let's grab Magnemite. Caesar Acceleration and Regal Stance. This card, draw five. All right, cool, Magneton. All right, that's good enough. We don't need Rare Candy uh, Magneton if we can do this. It'd be great, but not necessary.
All right, so we're we playing Lost Box, Jim Pal, probably Lost Box. No, no, it could be an electric deck. We get Maridon. Nope, Lost Box. Okay. Uh, oh, Lost Box. I get you're a mechanic, but you're just not that fun to play against. All right, what what you got in here? Colorus and Escape Rope. Kecleon. This Pokemon is the same type as any energy attached to it. Oh, this Pokemon is the same type as any basic energy. Okay, that's cool. So yeah, giving it fire energy will make it a fire type. Would make it do a lot of damage. That's smart. Okay, that's a neat little strat. Oof. All these energies gotta go. But that's alright, I can get at least two of them back on Dialga. Mel Mel go there. Bronzor go there. Alright. Hi Ramza! Five energy tactics is so good! How are you doing tonight? I hope you are doing well. We are up against the Lost Box deck. Oh, this Lost Box has Kecleon, which I think is pretty cool. I've never seen that before. It looks like it's got like a little bit of every energy in it. I wonder if it's gonna have Hobo. I'm doing pretty good today. Pokemon Live uh, TCG is still on fire. I think uh, like five five of the uh, eight games I've played were like crashes or like the the thing where it doesn't let you uh, play the game because it like loaded up two games at once. It's lovely. I love it. So much fun. Means in there five nice, super effective glasses. Whoa, what are those? When applying damage times three, oh, that's super smart. Yo, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Those glasses are super effective. Hey, there's Bronzong. Nice. Well, let's put this face guard on at least. Um, and what to do? What to do? We could. Grab a Bidoof. Yeah, I think Bidoof is the right choice. Because we're about to take two turns in a row, baby! Oh, thank you for the follow! Alright. Here we go. Star Kronos. Take another turn after this one. take our prize could really go for a boss's order right now oh another full face card okay well I guess to go on Melmetal what you're giving me the Greninja I mean if you say so yeah, let's at least use up all the cards we got oh wait you go there all right Greninja, you only have that much. I use the power of Bronzong 
to energy transfer. One, two, three, four. Done. All right, now let's switch places. I'm getting my card down as much as I can, so when I use Bebro's ability to draw to five, there's a higher chance I can grab a uh, a boss's order because I want to try and get that bird. Because even with the uh, the guard giving me like 20 defense, I still don't know if that's enough to survive a three times super effective uh, bird attack. Hmm. Does not look like it. All right, let's play Arden and grab Energy Recycler because I'm going to need that for next turn. Oh no, I grab a tool as well. Grab another face guard. I don't think I can really use it on anyone though. I think everyone else has an ability. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mel-Mel. I need you to take one for the team. Man, I could really use one of those Ionos I kept throwing away. I didn't throw away all of them, did I? One, two... No, okay, I should have one more. Oh, there it goes. It's got its energy. Let's see how much damage it does. I'm very curious. Now, we did stop it from getting stuff in the uh, Lost Box. Another Kecleon. You got another Fire Energy? Oh, Energy Recycler. Why? We've only got like three energy in there. Wow, you're way off from using Sableye, bro. Unless you got a uh, Colrus's Research, no? Oh, 250! Yes! The helmet paid off! The helmet paid off! This match is over. Let's use Crystal Cave to heal. And let's just punch the bird! Yeah, I knew I wasn't crazy putting the, the full face helmet on there. I really, really do wish I had an Ultra Ball for Magnezone, though. Didn't I, like, throw away all my Ultra Balls at the start? Yes, I did. Crap. Escape rope? Uh... I mean, it doesn't matter because I can just, uh, I have my own escape rope. Man, I cannot believe we survived that three times, like, uh, super effective attack. You've got six cards in the Lost Zone. Still not enough for Mirage Gate. And here's four off from Sableye. Do you have any Culver's research? Put one in there. Oh, okay. There's you recycling some of that energy, but you need to get a whole bunch more back. I don't know how you're going to put it down that fast. Maybe Ho would be good for that type of deck. Because it deals in like rainbow energy. Well, let's do this to heal. No metal again. We can do this every turn.
And now that we know that it's not a one-hit kill, we can go ahead and put Dialga back out too. Because Dialga's got a helmet. My steel types are so tanky. Come on, pick someone. Pick someone. Pick your poison. Oh, really? Yeah, that's what you want. Oh, man. Really could use an Iona from him right now. <laughs> The Magnazone. Sick. I wonder if I should split the energy among everyone in case Melmetal gets uh, knocked out. Because the Kramer could kill him, actually. Oh, wait, no, he's got the uh, the helmet on. Sableye could kill him. Because Sableye doesn't deal damage, he just puts damage counters on. Oh. Uh -huh. Mirage Gate, that's two energy. Are you going to be able to get an attack in? Mm, you're still three cards away from being able to use Sableye. Hey, Beach Court. Whoa, Cramorant, really? I would figure you'd go for the, uh, the Kecleon. Hmm, I guess even if I heal 30, it won't be enough. What to do, what to do? Let's do that. Do that. Hmm. You got magnet. Any energies you can grab me? Just one. Okay. Well, we'll put it on Dogger. Dogger sadly isn't good until the opponent's taken prize cards. How much damage do I do at the moment? 160. There's 40 more. We can move one of the energies off. If we're just going to die next turn. Let's use Crystal Cave to heal. And go for a Metal Blast. I just realized he doesn't have another glasses of super effectiveness. So he won't even be able to deal the 250. That's why he didn't uh, send it out and sent Kramer instead. Interesting. I mean, really, like, not much left to do. I'm on my last prize card. Unless he gets a Colrus, I don't think he can use Sableye, yeah. Even then, Sableye can only kill Vibarol. It could kill Bronzong, maybe, but it won't kill uh, Melbetal or anyone anymore.
I'm rooting for you, guy. Get at least one kill. You can do it. Use those glasses. Oh. Dang. Oh, that was a good match. I think they had a uh, slow kind of startup. Probably breaked early on. Oh, well. Rex, hello! Hello, hello, Raiders! Hello, 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 everyone! Let me give you a shout out. How was your koozies? It's going pretty good. It's a bit crazy. It is a bit crazy. Because this game is kind of falling apart. <laughs> it's... We traded in Yakuza style for lifestyle. Ah, I got you. You're on the second. The second storyline, right, Haruka? Isn't it super creepy when you have to do the jogging video? Like, people pay to watch idols jog. I just something about that is so unsettling to me. Oh, Haruka's third? Oh, okay. It's been a while. Oh, you have no idea? Okay, maybe you haven't done the done that yet, though. Okay, never mind. I mean, is that really a spoiler? It's just going to be one of the things you're going to have to do. Like, it has, it has no, like, plot relevance. <laughs> the new Yakuza game is going to have live action, live action actors for hostess dates. Kind of uh, skirting the, uh, what is it, the Uncanny Valley, huh? <laughs> it's... All right. Let's go Hamter Deck. And we're facing Mew V Max. Well, well, well. For how dramatic the theming of the man who discarded his name is supposed to be, <laughs> it's it's still having the hostess thing seems kind of uh uh what's the word I'm looking for? Thematically ill advised. Well, glad this person got to get their entire setup in one turn. Because while I have one palm on out. <laughs> At least the good thing is if I can get palm on out. What? Oh, okay. That's what you wanted to do. Cool. And a choice belt won't help you. I don't have any V Pokemon in my deck. Oh, I do have Reiku. That's true. Guess I could go get Reiku. Hmm. See if I can't draw something using his ability. Ooh, or maybe we should get Radiant Greninja. Ooh. Uh. Yeah, if it's draw, this is probably going to be the best option. This will this will net me two instead of one, and I don't have to spend the energy. I'll still have to spend the energy, but instead of retreating, I can just do this. All right, what do we get? We got Mew. Okay, Mew Mew's good. Mew's good. 
least maybe you can let us uh, uh, search for some more items. Buy us a bit more time, maybe. Yeah, there's me V Max. Else is Sparkle. Gonna get some fusion energy onto the board. Smart, smart, spreading it up. Alright, Genesect will allow them to draw up until the point where they have as many cards as they do fusion monsters. Alright. Luckily those keep crashing. They get heads, they could have got to uh, pull any card from their deck they wanted. Alright. Do they not have a switch or an escape rope? Come on, escape rope. Or a seal stone. I'll let them pull any card they want. Alright, the goal of this match is to try and kill all three of the Genesects. Gonna be tough. Actually, since I've bricked so hard. <laughs> There's a switch. Okay. Yeah, Palmont's gonna get wrecked. <sighs> or Palmy. I'd rather brick at them. I can't! The brick's just made of cardboard! <laughs> All right, Mew, let's see if maybe you can get me a card that's wonderful. Path to the Peak, it's a turn too late, but Path to the Peak is cool, I guess. I can't, I can't throw like Gambit. Electric Generator, I would have helped last turn. Mm. Yeah, and no, I got nothing. We'll just go ahead and concede. Got no draw avenue. We'll try one more match before we call it, though. So there's a uh, Pokemon TCG shorts on the Pokemon YouTube channel now. Uh, and then the last episode, the little girl like made it to uh, like the international scene. And she made it to the finals, but she loses, right? Which is supposed to be like this like thing where it's like, oh, it's okay. You know, you don't win them all. But in the back of my head, I'm like, no, 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 girl. You just go down to the loser's bracket. You're not out of the tournament yet. But the, but I guess they, they didn't do that in that particular tournament. I'm like, ah, so unrealistic. They did have the whole best of five, though. So that was actually pretty good. Why don't we go first? Mm, this would have been an instance where I think I would have liked to have gone first, but oh well. Alright. This hand is better. Don't know if it'll guarantee us the advantage, but there's hope. Ooh, basic V Pokemon in play don't have any abilities. Hey, that doesn't affect me any. Veritome is a good uh, counter for a lot of the uh, old school V, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Acceleration, V acceleration. Okay, you do have a retreat cost, okay. But you have switch. Okay, well, never mind. Ooh, Squilvert. And Giratina. What the heck kind of deck are you playing? Oh, I maybe just Arceus Giratina. 
You're just drawing down to one? You really expect me to have like an Iono or something? That's bold. I'm going to put down an energy and then I'm going to, I'm going to punch you with my little hamster. Hamster punch. And that's my turn. <laughs> I don't know what else you want from me. I lose Giratina VMAX. That's cool, but it doesn't really help you. Shuffle. Draw one. Oh, did you get a good supporter? Nope. Shit. Oh, sorry, bro. But I'm going to uh, take the initiative with this. I play Rare Candy to evolve Pidgey. And the Pidgeot skipping at stage one. Then I'll use Pidgeot EX's ability. Quick search. I can pull any card from my deck. And the card I will grab will be another rare candy. With this rare candy, I'll evolve Palmy into Palmod EX. Then by discarding two electric energy, I can do 220 damage onto any one of my opponent's Pokemon. Starting with Arceus. And because the V Pokemon got knocked out, I'm going to take two prize cards. And that's my turn. Seriously, a Pokemon TCG anime would be so cool. Like midway through the season they could introduce like a new set have to change have to change the decks up some everyone has like a multicolor theme ah uh, he quit okay i guess he realized that he breaked even harder well, that's just how it goes sometimes of course Quilvert. he tried his best he was grabbing all the nuts he could oh maybe don't fall to catch my cat here before she falls off the table. She just likes to roll over. Oh, well, those were some fun matches. Not all winners, but hey, that's just how it goes. And I guess we got to rank 200. Rank. What? I can't tell. Whatever. Oh, this game is so broken. Hopefully, tomorrow it's fixed. Hopefully patch tomorrow, do job. Alright, let's see. Who should we drop in on? Ooh, here we go. Nugget is playing Dead Space. Let's pass on the love over to our friend. Sorry, no Pokemon uh, gym of mine today. Uh, I'm just out of energy. <laughs> I overslept way too much. But uh, schedule should be out on the Twitter later today. And I think I already got it posted here on Twitch. So thank you all for coming by, hanging out. Y'all have a good rest of the night. Make sure to sleep well. And I'll see all y'all later. Bye, Q.